friends, welcome to the new year. Look out for fireworks. <laughs> we have returned to save the art community with fireworks and dressing gowns. This is my new one that I got for Christmas, isn't it, cozy? And does anyone remember us? It's been a long time since we last posted. Comment down below if you remember us. I don't. I didn't see any comments saying, uh, where did you go? So <laughs> I'm assuming no. I'm sure there'll probably be some that are like, I forgot you existed. Well, shame on you. <laughs> Look at you. Oh, I'm excited now I remembered what we're doing. Don't oh, So something I've started doing recently is making coloring books and I want to make it like my new year's goal, which I guess is this year now. This year's goal. Yeah, this year's goal is that I want to publish like a, a coloring book. Ooh, okay. So thanks to Patreon, um, I've got a ten dollar tier over there. But anyone who pledges on Patreon, you're helping fund me make coloring book pages. And I've got one to show you guys. <laughs> Casually walk out of frame. Okay. <laughs> There's plenty of fireworks to keep them entertained. <laughs> okay. Oh, welcome back, dear. <laughs> Hello. Oh, this one was last month's colouring page. There's a new oh, one. Oh, the frog! There. I like that one. I really like that I've one. I printed two of these out so that me and you can both have a go at colouring them and then we'll compare what our colouring screens look different to. Is my hair showing up on camera as well? It's very apricot. Apricot. Yeah, it's looking cute, dear. Who's this bobble hat champion? I got a bobble hat for Christmas, so of course I've got to represent. I'm um, so jealous of it. Look at that nice big red bubble. <laughs> it's like a cherry on a cake. Look at my gorgeous red bubble. Oh, oh. You've already like uncapped a Marco. Walk us through your colouring process. <laughs> well, I see a mushroom. And when I think of mushrooms, that one clearly is meant to be like a red and white one. But to that I say, ooh, I want this one to be a red and white one. So what I'm going to do... Oh, I like it when people throw a convention out the window. Is Ooh, that... that's cool! Yeah, I want this to be like a flat red and uh, white one. So. Oh, I've been loving seeing how other people have been colouring these in. Well, this is really satisfying. Satisfying for me as well. I'm like, yes! Colour that page in. I want to do a colouring page too. Wow. Well, you <laughs> Wow. Well. <laughs> well, you've stumbled into my domain, boy. Oh, if you did, then we can print it off and we can both do it and we'll put it on Patreon as well. So tell me, guys, um, we haven't seen you since, like, Christmas, I think? How did Christmas go for you? If you follow us on Twitch, obviously, you'll know we've been uh, around there quite a bit, but... How's it been going for you? Fill me in. What's been going on? Did we miss anything? Did we miss any drama we should know about? What about any recipes? <laughs> any seen, recipes? Seen any good recipes lately? They probably all had cranberries in them. <laughs> oh, I like a good cranberry. Go, go through the system very quickly, honey. You know, like, um, Christmas is associated with cranberries. Yes. Is New Year associated with anything? Alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> and lots of it. <laughs> that looks so cool! Of course it does, honey. I'm going into 2020 being more confident, guys, so whenever Steph gives me a compliment, it sounds so big-headed. Whenever Steph gives me a compliment now, I just say yes. That's good. Adam's therapy homework is, is that he needs to be confident. So far, it's not It's not going so well. <laughs> <laughs> oh, a blue mushroom! I thought I'd call that a blue shroom, honey. Blue shroom? I have to admit, guys, one question that I would like to put to you guys if you are watching or, or drawing along with this right now is do you have any experience like with colouring books? Because I honestly don't. I only really started looking into them when Steph said she wanted to do one. And just doing this right now uh, is super relaxing, honestly. It's, it's a... It's actually quite nice. And I want to know if you guys have had any experience. And if you have, like, what ones have you, like, done before? Yeah, because there's, like, a story behind how I got into mm -hmm. coloring books. So, as you might know, I've been doing hospital treatment the entirety of 2019. I've still got some more left in 2020. And um, at first, when I was first going to them, I was so anxious about, like, my appointments that in the waiting room they had uh, free colouring books and pencils to, to just grab hold To help of. people like distract themselves. Yeah, know. it's a brilliant way to like distract yourself before you've got like an appointment. Oh, I'm gonna give him blue eyes now. Just like that. I think there's a picture that might be on Twitter somewhere of me where hmm. I was holding up one of the colouring pages that I managed to complete. Oh, Yeah, go check that out guys. If I can see it, I'll put it on screen for yeah. you. Yeah, yeah, that is. This, this colour just says baby, so... 
<laughs> Perfect colour for Creston. In fact, I might have used the entirety of that colour for Creston. <laughs> really? I was going to say, it's like, mm, we can use it to our advantage. I mean, it's a bit dry, but it just means we can have a nice textured shaft on this mushroom. Oh, God. You could try it on the other side. Sometimes there's more. No, no. Oh, okay. I'm all for the... I was going to say I'm all for the shaft. I'm all for the <laughs> texture on this now, so... I think it looks all right. Because so far we've done very smooth things, so it's going to be nice to add some texture to it, I think, do you? Just like that. I need to start thinking about how to colour mine in as well, because I want to do it differently to yours. Why do you think I'm doing everything first? Because <laughs> that way I get free reign to do whatever I want. Oh, green bikes, that's a good frog colour. So I'm using the back of an advent calendar. Recycling. Well done, honey. That's good for the environment. <laughs> oh, this mark is very smelly. Oh my god. Is it a very alcoholy one? Stinks. And some of you guys might be thinking, oh, this video is literally to plug their Patreon. And to that I say, I don't care. <laughs> because <laughs> Steph's colouring pages are so cute and wholesome. Oh no! I've caused a disaster. It's like someone's got an ass out. <laughs> <laughs> got a butt full of markers now. <laughs> <laughs> that is a catastrophe, isn't it? Oh, we're good with the puns today, honey. I'm loving it. Something else that I've been doing recently as well, oh, yeah. you might notice, I have brought in my iPad over here. Let me just sneakily... Oh, can you hold this? No. Okay, he said no. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't anticipating a no. I can do it in a moment. I'm just a very busy inky boy right now. I've been drawing comics on it and sharing them over like the Christmas holidays. This is one that I was really surprised that it blew up on Instagram and it it's it has really like over 9,000 likes. That's the most I've ever had on like an Instagram post. So if you're one of the people who like that, thank you. Because it's hashtag relatable content, dear. Oh, I, I really want to spend more of like this year of being able to draw things. I think you're off to a great start. You've been uh, super productive in the uh, first few, well, few days of this year. Honestly, we're only a couple of days in. <laughs> Woo! Okay, there's me green bright, b b b b b green brass frog. B b b b oh, I'll give him green uh, eyebrows. Okay, I'm a little plump apricot. What are we gonna do together right now? Just call me a plump apricot. Yeah, you're ready for the picking, honey. <laughs> <laughs> I've just picked this nice lilac-y colour. It's called pale lilac. Right. I've done a swatch. Quite like the look of that swatch. I don't want to look at that. <laughs> I've decided I want to do my frogum in this colour. I always film from the right of you, and you're right-handed. I could call it in my left hand, but it would look considerably yeah. worse. Oh, 2015 cold, and it wants its challenge back. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't seen anyone do like, you know, like your other hand challenge. I haven't seen that in forever. Our challenges just aren't seemingly like a thing on YouTube anymore. I feel a bit like confused with what is a thing apart from like giving away a lot of money or saying something mean about something. Or like drawing with your butt cheeks exposed. <laughs> but even then that'd get demonetized. Think of the clicks, honey. My butt's ready for its 15 seconds of fame. <laughs> right, how's this getting on? Drawing a face on my boyfriend's butt cheeks. <gasps> yeah. Call me Mr. Cheeks, honey. I would have normally done probably like a green frog, but because yours is green, I'm like, no, my frog needs to be different. I wanted a classic green frog. This is your colouring page as well, so you should be able to adapt to anything. You created this, hun. I do like that so far. The possibilities are endless. I mean, it goes, this is just, um, you know, regular printer paper, but I've always loved how smooth the hoo hoo markers go on just regular printer paper. Yeah, I don't mind using uh, markers on regular printer paper. My very first sketchbook tour, um, I was using regular printer paper and then, like, sticking them inside. Yeah, we're not exactly fancy here, are we? That can be our vibe for this year. Cheap. <laughs> Plus side, though, your frog's looking very cute. I think that's what I'm best at sticking to, you know? Just talking about frogs, colouring in frogs. If anyone needs any professional opinions, ask someone who seems to know what's going on in the universe and how to change it. The frog universe. <laughs> Steph is not the person to come to with your problems. I'm sorry, I'm barely coping on my own over here. <laughs> oh, I just saw some creative liberties going on over here. <laughs> you know I'm all for creative liberties, honey. <gasps> These are the moments I live for. Look, eyelids. Because yes. my frog's really chill. He's been, I think he might have sampled that mushroom. <laughs> and he's, he's like, all of a sudden he's like, wow. Is that what's done? He's like licked the mushroom. <laughs> oh, look, oh, you've given yours cheek. I really like that. I like the cheeks. That was my creative liberty. <laughs> was that what that I'm going to give mine red armbands. There we go. 
I like using this red just because it doesn't look like it's been used very much. So like it has loads, quite a kick to it. Loads of ink or pigment or whatever that goes on. Juicy. I might give the bee a red eye too. <laughs> wow, I've not seen anyone <laughs> do that yet. <laughs> <laughs> Tag yourself. I'm chaotic energy B. What else? What color? Because if we're gonna go for like like psychedelic, I guess we could go for. Oh, like, is that what your theme is? Yeah. <laughs> like everything's sort of part normal, but everything's slowly changing. So. Like the seventies. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I've thought the sixties was psychedelic, honey. Oh no, my facts are all wrong. I think in the seventies they had big trousers. There were flares, weren't there? There we go. Flared trousers? Is that what that was? Step facts. Let us know if you still wear flares, guys. <laughs> Let's not make that that piece. That's yellow, right? Yeah. I like how you look at what the colour is, like, after you've already started colouring with it. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> there we go. Oh, mm. I want it to look like... Um... Like some of the colors are right, but some of them aren't. So it just looks ever so slightly like off and wrong. Oh, is this what it's like to be colorblind? Yes, every day. <laughs> I, f I fear going outside for seeing a red-eyed bee. <laughs> <laughs> when we did that colorblind video, that was the first time I went outside and I wasn't afraid. <laughs> In fact, I might even make it like a, a gloopy. Why is it gloopy? Have you ever seen a frog's tongue? They're really sticky. Yeah, but they don't drip. <laughs> this one does. He's... It looks like he's dripping blood. <laughs> oh, he's been he's been eating a lot of bees. <laughs> <laughs> His tongue's like burning. <laughs> is that is that meme? Every moment of my life is pain. <laughs> Chow down, frog. Oh, he's looking cute, isn't he? I like him. Your idea of cute is very different to mine. Well, I'm very broken, dear. <laughs> the difference in aesthetics. <laughs> <laughs> Mine's like a, a fairy frog and yours is like spawn of Satan. <laughs> Excuse you. Art is interpretation, honey, and I'm interpreting this as a good time. <laughs> this is what Adam does on the weekends. <laughs> don't, don't say I don't. <laughs> that you are going to give people the wrong idea. He eats bees. <laughs> oh, I thought you was going to say like do mushrooms. <laughs> I was gonna say, we live together, oh my god! <laughs> I thought you were just horrified that people might think you actually eat bees. He's a bee eater, get him! <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's been fun to uh, colour one of your pages though, because I've seen everybody else having fun and I want to do it. I had a friend come to visit me recently, and I forced her to sit down with a colour and buck and colour yeah, in with me. travelled all that way to come and see Steph, and she's like, I've got homework for you! <laughs> <laughs> it wasn't even like my own drawings, it was just some colouring books that I had and I was like, use these, I want to watch you have a good time. <laughs> I want to watch you have a good time, because my art is guaranteed a good time. I think it's nice because you don't have to worry about like what you're going to draw. That's true, Steph's already done that for you. I don't think this is that gruesome. Should we just have everything dripping? That might be kind of... <laughs> I don't think this is that gruesome. <laughs> Let's find ways to make it though. <laughs> Like, this is a real, like, inky cap because it's dripping, right? I'm struggling to keep the focus on that. Oh god, even the camera's starting to go trippy, so whoa! Oh, that looks really cool, I like that. See? See, you, you make fun of me. But then you realise that I'm a savant and I have great ideas. <laughs> is that what I've realised? Yeah, totally. <laughs> I get so distracted with, like, how you're doing it because you're doing all kinds of things that I didn't expect to happen, so I'm like, oh... I'm gonna monitor this. <laughs> How can I monetize this? <laughs> monitor, not monetize. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> and that one can be drip. Everything can just be dripping. Oh yeah, that's all. Yeah, well, that's all. I've come for an update, honey. It's looking very cute. Oh, you've given him wings. Why didn't I think of that? Well, because yours is like so chaotic, oh. I wanted to go for more of like a fairy and, and a night garden kind of aesthetic. Fairy frog mother. Yeah. <laughs> That's looking really cute. I do, I like the um, sort of like the semi-circle background that you've been doing as well. That's really nice. I didn't have a pencil to put it in with, so I had to kind of guess it with markers. It went a, a bit wibbly wobbly. But... That looks good. I like it. 
I'm relaxing. You can't see, guys, because I want to keep mine a surprise, but she's copying my idea right now. No, I'm not. <laughs> Those are meant to be stars in the mm, sky. Very suspicious looking here. <laughs> I like how I was saying about how colouring pages are a really good excuse to relax. Meanwhile, we turn it into a competitive sport. <laughs> hey, it's not competitive when someone's just stealing your idea. <laughs> Oh, I'm only, I'm only playing. Oh, it's really cute. I do really like yours so far. Oh. I've seen some people interpret this as like a lily pad, and I like seeing like how yeah, different people really cool. color it in different ways. Yeah, I never want there to be like a right or a wrong way with how to color these. That's it. You, you're free to interpret as you know, however you want. And it's certainly from both of us so far. It's definitely coming out that way. Okay, so here's our attempts at colouring one of Steph's very own colouring pages. I do like how yours came out cute and mine came out... different. <laughs> I went for like a fairy aesthetic and yours is like... Mine's like one of those PSAs for not eating mushrooms you find in the, <laughs> find in the forest. <laughs> yeah, don't do that. One thing you should do though, guys, is like and subscribe so we can see you next time for another Doodle Date. Ooh. And I haven't had a chance to wag all these around in Oh yeah, a while. you should also buy our books. <laughs> <laughs> Until the next one, see you soon guys. Bye! Bye bye.